Yo, yo, welcome back. Today's video, super simple. It's how to add the Flipper sub gig files to the Portifex H4M for the Flipper TX area. If you don't have a Flipper Zero and you have a Portifex H4M or H2 and you want to do some Flipper Zero type stuff like mostly the sub gig hertz stuff, then this is going to be great for you to do. So if you go to the transmit side of things and we're going to scroll down, we went over ADS-B in our last video. BLE spam, we're not going to go over because it's been done so many times. Uh, Burger Pager, uh, I've done that on the Poxag video like a while back. Uh, so similar stuff there. CVS spam, that's pretty easy as well. Stuff going in there and activating the customer uh, help buttons really is all that is. We're going to go ahead and skip those three areas. And we're just going to go right into that Flipper TX area. This is really simple. Two main areas, browse and then start. And then your frequency is up there at the top, and then you have your gain, and then your amp. That's really there is for this. It's super, it's more slimmed down than all the other apps that we've gone over. So to add files, I wanna to go to Zero Sploit uh, GitHub re repository. I know that there's a few repositories out there for um, Flipper Zero, SubGig, IR, just massive dumps that people have done. And it's just one massive folder is all there really is. And from there we have just a plethora of files that also in each one of those files then has another folder and then the actual sub gig data that, that, we're, that we're looking for, right? So like here I'm in vehicles, a uh, very standard, you know, one like the Teslas that we've all seen. Uh, you tap on Tesla and then there we have the best port opener, then the frequency for the Teslas depending on the that you're in so us uk so this is kind of where the files are stored at now if you don't know how to download files from uh github uh the code here you're going to tap on that and then download zip and then once you have your zip downloaded you can then uh, unpack that zip whether you're on mac os or on windows just extract all and you're going to go ahead and eject your sd card out of your porta pack but all you're going to do is just take that extracted folder that you get from github and then you're going to then dump it into the sub gig folder of your Fortifact H4M or H2. And then that is really that. After that, you can put your SD card back into your port pack and you can reboot it. And then when you go to the Flipper TX area that we're in right now, we can go to browse there. Now, let's say I want to do a ceiling fan, right? So I want to go to this Hampton Bay ceiling fan. Now, some of these may not load uh, depending on the structure of them. Just a little, little note there. Uh, you can look at the GitHub Mayhem documentation page, and then you can kind of read through what they say can and, and won't work. So in this case, this won't work. Let's go back to that sub gigs folder. And then let's go ahead and do, let's just do customer... Let's do customer assistance buttons. So we're going to go to the lows. And so for this one, for instance, this is a customer button for lows. To show you that this does work, I'm going to use my Flipper Zero. And I'm going to go to sub gigs. I'm going to go to frequency analyzer. And whenever I hit start here, we should see this populate up on, on the Flipper Zero. So let's go ahead and hit start. Now, some of these are so short that you may not see anything at all. Try to find one that has more of a data and you can look at the kilobytes of what that file is um, to kind of help you unlock something. So you can see here that we did receive, yeah. So you can see here that we did receive something there on the Flipper Zero under the 433.889 megahertz band. So if I click on that guy and I open that guy up and then if I hit start again, we should be able then to decode that and then save that. Let's try that again, start, maybe. There we go. Now you can see here that under the Flipper Zero that we were able to copy that complete uh, sub gigs and then the bin raw, and then we can go and look at the actual keys and all that fun stuff. And then we can save it, and then we can actually then just go back and do this vicious cycle of transmit and receive, transmit and receive. That's pretty much really it for the Flipper Zero or the Flipper TX side of things on the Portifex H4M. And I found this kind of interesting because uh, I know that the cost of Flipper Zero has gone up because of tariffs. 
and all that fun stuff. So uh, some guys have been have not been able to get one, but uh, you may already have a H2 or an H4M. So this is something where you can you, even even a hacker ref board can do this kind of stuff too. So this is some stuff that you can look into uh, if, if you wanted to get into the flipper sub gigs type stuff. Yeah, I would like to thank a semi sponsor of this video today is Open Source SCR Labs. Um, rocking this really nice, cool shirt that they sent me. Uh, it's got Mayhem, Root, at Mayhem, and then we got uh, a little dirt on it, but plus radio control achieved down there. So, and then they also have this guy right here that they sent me. This is the Mayhem 315-433-868 and 915 radio control achieved shirt. Uh, got the little sine wave there. And then in between you got Mayhem and then just a band shirt. They have a few more too. Uh, I'll put a link in the description below. And then I will also put a link in the description below for a coupon for Open Source SCR Labs uh, to save a few bucks. Um, but yeah, thank you Open Source SCR Labs for kind of sponsoring this video, really. Sending me some goodies and some new toys to play with in the coming weeks and months. Uh, so yeah, stay tuned for that. Got me a Libre SDR and then a Nano VNA FV3. Start doing some proper antenna videos and such. Thanks for your time, appreciate you guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe to all the fun stuff. If you have any questions, reach out in the comments below or hit me up on Discord again, and I will see you guys in the next video.